It is barely a week since the Kenya Medical Practitioners, Pharmacists and Dentists Union said they would call for a strike if issues bedeviling the medical fraternity in Kimbu are not addressed. A spot check by Channel 1 revealed that health workers in Kimbu have gone on a go slow, saying the return to work formula has not been implemented as per the agreement. The practitioners are agitating for the promotion of doctors, dentists and pharmacists, payment of salaries at the end of each month, not later than third of the subsequent month, and a change of terms of service to permanent and pensionable. I wish to bring to the attention of the Kiabu residents that uh, services are continuing in the hospitals and our consultants uh, are busy and uh, they are really working very hard to make services uh, come to the level that is uh, acceptable within the county and the medical officer interns are also continuing uh, working within the, the, our 12 hospitals in the county. Meanwhile, in Moranga County, the deadlock between the health workers employed five years ago under the Economic Stimuli Program, ESP, and Moranga County government continues. But the health workers are not letting up, yet the county government insists there is no money. The health workers who began a protest on Wednesday last week have been agitating for absorption to permanent and pensionable towns by the Moranga County government. They're basing their demands on a circular issued in January by the health ministry demanding that all the health workers under the ESP be employed employed on permanent and pensionable towns. Speaking during a press briefing, the health workers who had gathered at the county offices expressed their dissatisfaction after a meeting between them and the Public Service Board bore no fruit. We don't want any excuses. Enough is enough. They have been, uh, the, their contract have been extended from June last year. Now they are adding another contract for six more months, which we have not taken. So can they do the needful? They further threaten to mobilize their colleagues who are on permanent terms to join the protest. Caroline Kamar reporting for Channel 1, News R.